during the emergency, if uh, uh, one doesn't trust others, so that uh, things will not move. Anyway, there's a, like if you clap with one hand, it doesn't make a sound. So to make a sound, you need to have another one. So that makes a sound. So it's like way, you know, uh, national and international has to trust each other so that the uh, emergency response will be, uh, no, have, uh, can go smoothly. So there needs to be harmony, uh, there needs to be synergy, and there needs to be trust between these two entities for even uh, any intervention to take place seamlessly. So trust is important because it allows for governments and the people uh, to think freely, come up with the solutions freely, um, without fear that uh, we might be uh, giving out too much information that might be used to give advantage to another entity. Uh, the same with organization. They need to trust governments uh, that whatever support that is being given to our community reaches the community and does not end up uh, uh, to waste or benefiting a few people and not an entire community. So yes, trust is key. WFP has worked with the government of Kenya for quite a long time now. We are talking about 40 years plus. And over the course of these 40 years, we've been able to build a partnership. We've been able to build a relationship um, within which um, we have been able to you know, establish some level of trust. And um, the government of Kenya, I believe at this point, you know, sees a valuable partner in um, capacity investments, capacity, capacity strengthening in WFP. And through this uh, partnership, we've been able to work on very many projects together. Because uh, we are all in this thing together. That's the objective. We have one objective to address emergencies and reduce the impact of damage or losing lives or when, when the emergency strikes. So we are a team, we are in partnership, we are equal partners, so trust has to be there for us to fulfill the objective. So we really need to trust each other, we share information periodically and we do things together. So the government of Zimbabwe is ready to partner those who are willingly to do uh, to assist the government to achieve its desired goals through a mutual understanding and the sharing of mutual objectives.